Welcome to the Zip Store, one day and we'll be Hollywood home on a budget. Call me a fiddler on the roof or a DJ in the garage, but to me, tradition is everything. And for many high schoolers, one of the most important and celebrated traditions is prom. And there's no mystery why. Who will get asked out? Which prom K219 post will be the talk of the town on social media? Who will have the hottest prom dress? Or tuxedo? Or corsage? Who will be the belle of the ball? Or the bay of the bass? Which couple is most likely to smooch? And who will have their heads submerged in the punch? The seniors! The seniors! The juniors! The juniors! Tradition! Tradition! Prom is a tradition I do not follow, but have a very deep reverence for. Thus, you see the guide and catalog before you. This is the prom book, the guide, and the Stumps Party Prom Catalog. The only thing this does not sell in here are dresses. Anyway, let's get started with the prom book, and it's always good to get some prom inspiration, especially for free, as is the case with both of these books. So here we go, The Prom Book by Lauren Metz, writer for Seventeen Magazine and dozens of other major media outlets like E! Online and Alloy Entertainment. Includes bonus keepsake pages for photos and memories. So let's take a look at the back first. Retail price is $16.99 US and higher in Canada, although it doesn't specify. It's from Zest Books. For most teens, prom is the biggest night of their high school lives. There's fashion, romance, dancing, and drama. Some things like who makes out with whom and who gets voted prom queen can't be planned for. But for everything else, there's the prom book. Who's making out with whom and who gets voted prom queen? Well, that's just all a part of Tradition! This comprehensive guide includes insider tips from a huge range of celebrity contributors called from the worlds of fashion, party planning, makeup, and beyond to help you deal with every eventuality. And in addition to tons of great planning advice, the prom book also features colorful sidebars, useful fill-in seats, and real teen tips, a couple of which I want to show you in here, that turn the entire planning process into just another, another part of the fun. And just another memory that we'll be telling our grandchildren about. Inside, you'll learn what you need to bring with you on prom night, how to get to and from the dance in style and on a budget. Pay attention because you're going to want to create a budget and stick to that budget for the entire process. Essential secrets for dealing with minor emergencies like pimples, wardrobe malfunctions, and transportation problems. How to find an amazing, affordable dress and what to do with it after the big night is over. A lot of work goes into planning that special night, but now teens can relax and enjoy the perfect prom, knowing that they've already taken care of all the little details. The prom book's heavy fill-in sections that the editor's book also double as a keepsake for recording all the dancing, partying, and post-prom fallout. So start making your appointments now, because prom is happening sooner than you think. See you at the after party. Of the dozens of tips from real teams on how to make the prom process more enjoyable, there are two from New Jersey that I want to share with you. First one, makeup wise, is Emma Glickman, age 16 from Livingston. I got my makeup done at a department store so it was free, although you're usually expected to purchase one or two of the products used on your look. And Eric Lederman, age 15 from Martinsville. He says if a guy asks a girl to prom, unless he is not in the financial position to do so, he should pay for everything, except transportation, which should be split. Since the boy asked the girl, he should make it a worry free and enjoyable experience for her. Prom is like an amazing and expensive date. And that's one of my beliefs about prom, by the way. Uh, it's an extremely glorified version of dinner and dancing with no real room for intimacy due to all the adult chaperones. However, if the girl asks the guy, then they should split all the costs. It's common courtesy for the guy to pay, and splitting is a fair compromise. Now well, look at that, Eric Lederman. At age 15, you're a gentleman and a scholar, but mostly a scholar. And yes, there is plenty of celeb inspo to satiate even myself. Hello, we bring Hollywood home on a budget. If this didn't have any celebrity contributors or inspiration, um, this would be a no-go. But here we have Vanessa Hudgens, Sharon Leal, I'll have to IMDB her, Jennifer Lawrence, no reason to IMDB her, I hate the living daylights out of her, Selena Gomez, Emma Stone, Twilight's Ashley Green, 
Miranda Cosgrove, Blake Lively, Dakota Fanning, Taylor Swift, and Amanda Seyfried. Even though I'm a prom skeptic, I will concede that this covers all of the aspects and variables prom related that you will be left with no question after you're done reading this. Part 1, Prom Planning, Your Ultimate Countdown, Breaking Down the Budget, Booking Your Wheels, that's transportation, What About Dinner, Planning Your Look, Navigating the Dating Situation. I know I will be the talk of the town in the worst way possible when I'm forced to bring my mother as my date to my senior prom that she's forcing me to attend next semester or there will be no allowance! Thanks a lot! Part 2, Prom Day, Your Schedule, how to get glowing skin, makeup tips for the pros, hairstyles you can do, and nailing it. That would be nail style, of which I have none to sew for. By the way, all the celeb photos that I showed you in this video, then related to these two sections here in part two, section nine and section ten. Hey there, it's Lauren Metz, author of the prom book, The Only Guide You'll Ever Need. Today, we're here to talk about beauty on a budget. So number one, before prom, sign up for every daily deal site that you can find. There's Groupon, Living Social, Life Booker, there's plenty out there and you'll get deals on spray tans, mani pedis, haircuts, highlights, anything you're looking for, you can find a deal on it. Next, on the day of prom, you want to schedule an appointment to have your makeup done at a beauty counter, either in a department store or a Sephora. It will usually cost you around $50 to $100, but they'll do your whole face for you for a professional look, and you get to go home with the beauty products. So that's how to get your look professionally done on a budget. Part 3, Prom Night. Hosting a pre-prom party, how to keep the party going, and how to stay safe and sane. And finally, part four, post-prom, what to do with your dress, and looking back with fondness. And that's where the handy fill-in sections come into play. Looking back, the details on where and when your prom was held, your ride, your look, what to write about your date, the dance, your dinner, and the after party. You could also write your favorite moments, your most embarrassing moments, notes from friends and family, and even attach photos from your prom in this section here. Which I think is particularly neat. And the prom after party too. And the pre-prom. All in all, this is a thorough, indispensable guide to have around for prom fanatics and just plain fun to read for prom skeptics like myself. It's attractive to read the dialogue and language is relatable, and it should be because Lauren Metz, as I said, wrote for major uh, media outlets, Hello Entertainment, Bravo, AOL, and Seventeen Magazine, where she began her professional career. And she also got her feet wet in the prom pool three times in the course of a week. That's right, she went to three different proms in the course of seven days. This girl is practically a promenade veteran. If I had went to three proms within a week, I probably would turn myself into the mental asylum. Good job, Lauren Metz. Now, on to the prom catalog. The Stumps Party Prom Catalog for 2019. Make your night a Hollywood night. Hello, we bring Hollywood home on a budget. I see no reason to exclude this. I got this in a very peculiar way. I actually got this... Through the permission of my school secretary, a lot of the cellists, who is Don Keely, if I do say so myself. So, uh, I have her to thank for this. Make your night a Hollywood night. And this also helps to support the Tim Tebow Foundation's Night to Sign initiative for people who have different disabilities and they want to attend prom too. This also has exclusive awards for VIP members. So, definitely, without a doubt, the focal point of this section of the program is the Hollywood themes. And we have several of them, several variations on this. Lights, camera, party, Hollywood Hills lights, vintage Hollywood, hooray for Hollywood, Hollywood premiere, glimmer of Hollywood, and... A wet carpet affair. Now, if you're not into the Hollywood theme, there's also a Vegas theme. There's a Times Square theme, and you know how very much I'm fond of New York. We also have a casino theme. 
another variation on a Vegas theme. We have a Western theme, Under the Sea, Midnight in Paris, uh, Decade Side, 70s, 80s, 90s, maybe even the 60s. There's foreign themes like Escape to India, a Garden theme, so many themes. There's even a Visible Arts theme and a Hasbro Game Night theme, which is something particularly nice to, uh, Check out. And if you're not into big prom venues, you can certainly order the quick kits. Quick kits are great for smaller spaces, decorating in a hurry, and photo ops. So you can order condensed versions of the Hollywood theme or other themes which I just mentioned for considerably less. Now, by no means is this breeding prom home on a budget, but sometimes you gotta pay to play. And if you're looking for a particular item for your prom decorations, big or small venues, then check out the index here. Fabric, favors, invites and tickets, decorations, table decor, and decorating materials. You can find them here on the index along with the pages on which they are located on. My only problem with this is that it's a little bit awkward to handle and awkward to hold. So, if I'm just reading this for recreational purposes, it should be a tad bit, I don't know, awkward and cumbersome to hold on to. But I got it for free from my school, and there are plenty of eye-catching models in here, like the one on the cover, to see the need of anyone who has even a remote interest in catalogs like these. And I do, so this is pretty gosh darn nice, even if it's a bit hard to hold. So, final verdict. For the prom book, 5 out of 5. And for the prom catalog from StumpsParty.com, 4 out of 5. So, in total, that is a 9 out of 10. For a prom skeptic like myself, that's a pretty impressive grade. And yes, I am and always will be a prom skeptic. But, take my word for it, or don't, prom is indeed tradition! And it's one that we will look back on with fondness as we regale tales about our escapades that night to our future grandchildren. So, I guess prom is one tradition that we can let stick around for a while longer. Thank you guys so much for watching, and in all seriousness, I hope you had a terrific prom if you attended. I'll catch you on the flip side.